So hi friends, this is Amit and you are watching my channel Information and Special Video. So here I will provide you the complete analysis of SIFT 1 and SIFT 2, both examination of Comet K 2022. As you all know, the SIFT 1 was already done in the morning session and SIFT 2 is already done now. So I have got lots of feedback and for the, the SIFT 1, I have already provided the video, but now I am having the more feedback from the students. So I, have, I will provide you the complete analysis of SIFT 1 and SIFT 2. So first of all, if you will talk about the SIP2 paper, yes, as I, I got the feedback from the student who have just oh, come, come out from the examination. So the first reaction was the Comet K paper was a little bit tricky this year. It was not as per the previous year. So you can expect this will have an effect on marks versus rank data and also on the cutoff of colleges. So that, that information I will be providing you very soon in the same channel that is marks versus rank versus branch for top 5, top 10, top 20 colleges. So you can subscribe to the channel so that you will get that video very soon in the same channel and also you will be getting all the update and information not only about committee but for other entrance exam other counseling also in the same channel. So now if you talk about the detailed analysis of the paper so Mathematics was a little bit lengthy because the because the question of mathematics was taking more time. So that's why students find the mathematics paper a little bit tough because as you also know in Comet K there was more number of questions. And if you will compare it with KCAT examination difficulty is low but the overall comparison is similar because, because of the time factor. Because in KCAT examination there is different shift for different uh, different subject examination that is that is physics, chemistry, so math. There is, so there is no problem for timing. There is the problem of toughness of the paper but here the problem is with timing toughness of the paper is not the big problem for the student but the timing is very important that's why the mathematics was the toughest and physics was also a little bit tricky because the question we are from different type of concept from physics but the chapter if you will ask from where the question we are asked mostly in mathematics and physics i will suggest the you the question we are asked mostly from those, those chapter that i have suggested in my previous video that is the strategy video of comet so if you are preparing for next year of comet k you can check all those videos so that you will be preparing in a better manner for the comet k examination because there are some topics that are that are having the more weightage in the comet k examination so now if you talk about the chemistry chemistry used, used to be the easiest among all the subjects in any type of entrance examination but here chemistry was also a little bit tricky and try to listen my word very carefully many students will disagree and write in the comment section so it may be your personal opinion or your you may have not done better preparation i am not pointing any any one particular student but there may be a case that uh, in the covid situation you may not able to do your preparation in a better manner that's why you find the paper tough the paper but level was not so much difficult but the problem is there with the timing so that's why students find it difficult because solving 180 question in 180 minutes is not easy that's why this will have an effect on marks versus rank as well see to an analysis many students are saying that the uh, chemistry was toughest but i don't think chemistry can be the toughest subject because they have because the question in the chemistry will be a straightforward if you know you will solve otherwise you will not solve so there is nothing like you will do a uh, wrong answer or anything yeah, of course here uh, there is no negative marking but if you will uh, solve the solve the question incorrectly you will not get any type of marks so, so now, now if you will compare the shift one and shift two paper then i will say there was similarity in the difficulty level some student may say my uh, my shift was difficult and, and other will say my shift was difficult but i think they have provided the uniform difficulty level in in shift one and shift two that's why they will consider the marks directly for the for ranking the system of comet k so very soon they are going to provide the, the answer key also so i will try to provide you the information related to that that is from 20. so now i would like to introduce the philo app where you can get the solution of all your question doubt or you have problem with any type of concept related to j or neat or boards examination then you can get the solution 24 by 7 with these three easy steps that is first you have to download the philo app in the play store and then you have to do the sign up process using your mobile number and after that take the photo of your question and upload that in the app and after that within 60 seconds you will be connected to the india's best educator in question you want to say how much power is in the bulb the bulb is operating at 220 volts right this battery voltage is given at 220 so this is a simple relation here so without wasting your time, download the Philo app link is available in the description box and use the code IEB001. You will get the 10% instant discount. Thanks. From 22nd, they will be providing you the answer key that is provisional answer key and up, up to 24th, you will be able to challenge the answer key if you will think any, any type of problem in your answer key. Uh, and and based on that challenge, they will give you a final answer key and after that, they will provide the result on the 5th of July. So this was the complete information related to the Comet K examination of 
2022 sip 1 sip 2 both i have discussed that is the paper, paper was moderate level neither, neither hard nor easy but some student find it difficult because as i said in this covid uh, period many, many students were not able to do their preparation properly in the online coaching system so that's why they find it difficult and it will have the effect uh, on the marks versus rank also try to understand my word you have to compete with the student that are going to uh, going for the exam so not for the not with the student that have already done the last year exam so, so if the paper is difficult or you have uh, find the paper difficult it will be difficult for everyone and it is competition here you need to put the other student behind you that uh, then you will be getting the better rank in the examination so no need to worry if it is hard if it will be for everyone if it is easy it will be for everyone i have just provided you the information what i whatever i have got from the feedback of the student because it is not possible to uh, know all the question because this time because format k is a computer based examination so it, it is not possible to get all the question but the, whatever the feedback i got from lots of student i have provided you the detail so very soon i will be providing you the marks versus rank versus college data so please try to watch the video in the same channel and for that you need to subscribe the channel so that you will be getting that video very soon in the same channel thanks